Hey Jackals fans, Billy the Bat Boy here with your Jackals pregame report. Yesterday, the Jackals swept the doubleheader against Quebec. In the first game, the Jackals walked it off in the eighth inning with a final score of 3-2. Second baseman Nelson Ward drove in the winning run on a bunt single. Here's what Nelson has to say about the crazy finish. Uh, coming up there in the uh, extra innings in the eighth inning there of that seven inning game, um, just looking uh, for a way to get a run in or get the bases loaded. That uh, wouldn't run the third with less than two outs and saw that I had a chance to bunt them over and so tried to bunt them over for a base hit and uh, the guy bobbled it and allowed uh, Torino to score from second and just a uh, good team win there. For game two, the Jackals defeated Quebec by a score of 12 to four. Newly acquired Stervin Matos hit a three run homer in the second inning, earning the PSCNG Power Player of the Game honors. Here's what Stern has to say about his first day as a Jackal. Really excited for the, my first day in the New York Jersey Jackals. Um, I hit a home run yesterday, I'm triple two. I'm looking around the, in the home play on my, on my pitch. I'm keep, walk, uh, keep swinging and that's okay, I'm enjoying the game. The Jackals are currently 23 and 18, third in the Can-Am League. Today, the Jackals will send right-hand pitcher Lendy Castillo to the mound to face Quebec's David Richardson. Tomorrow, the Jackals will wrap up this four-game series before heading over to Sussex County. We'd also like to congratulate Edward Reyes, Alfredo Marte, Jay Gonzalez, Conrad Greger, and Richard Stock for making the Can-Am League All-Star team. I'm Billy the Bat Boy, and that's your Jackals pregame report.